Here's the Elliott Wave forecast for March 1st, 2011. On the S&P 10 day chart, um, the move from 1294 to 1328 approximately could be a Wave 1, but in order for this to be a Wave 1 at least, you need to take out uh, 1333, which is the 0 0.786 retracement of the drop from 1344 to 1294. So a break of 1333 would be um, would set up a move to, to take out the 10 day high around 1344. For NASDAQ, after the corrective wave from 2840 to 2710, we got possibly an impulse up, but um, in order for this to be an impulse, it would need to hold at least uh, 2745 and rally back over 2812 with the 0.786 retracement of the drop from 2840 to 2710. So we've got to watch 2812 in the coming days. The Dow. It actually uh, retraced. The 12,250 is, is around the 0.618 retracement level, and you need to break that and then take out at least 12,300 to the upside. If you can take out 12,300, that would be the 0.786 retracement approximately of the drop from uh, 12,380 to uh, 12,000. So for, for the Dow, the level to watch for this week is around 12,300. For NASDAQ, we, got off, we have to watch both... Uh, uh, 2745 and uh, 2812. Uh, 2812 is 0.786, and for S&P, 0.786 is uh, 1333. Basically, if we can take out 0.786 on, on the three indices, it would set up a move to take out the 10-day highs, or the 52-week um, high. That's a wrap.